Understanding Whitewashed Walls in English. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we explore the fascinating world of English phrases and idioms. Today, we're diving into the meaning and usage of the phrase, whitewashed walls. This phrase is not just about painting walls but carries a deeper, more metaphorical meaning. So, let's get started and uncover the layers behind this interesting expression. Whitewashed walls literally refers to walls that have been painted with whitewash. Whitewash is a type of paint made from slaked lime, or chalk, and water, used for centuries to give walls a bright, white appearance. This method is cost-effective and has been popular for its simplicity and cleanliness. However, the literal meaning is just the tip of the iceberg. When we move beyond the literal interpretation, whitewashed walls often implies an attempt to cover up flaws or imperfections. Just like whitewash can make old, dirty walls look clean and new, the phrase can suggest a superficial or deceptive attempt to make something undesirable appear acceptable or pleasant. In everyday conversation and literature, whitewashed walls is used to describe situations where unpleasant realities are covered up or glossed over. For instance, if a company is hiding its financial problems, one might say they're whitewashing the walls of their financial situation. It's crucial to understand the context in which the phrase is used, as it often carries a tone of criticism or skepticism. The term, whitewash, has been used in various cultural and historical contexts, often in a critical sense. For example, in politics and media, whitewashing can refer to the practice of downplaying or ignoring controversial or harmful aspects of something. Understanding these references helps in comprehending the full depth of the phrase. Whitewashed walls is a phrase rich in meaning, extending far beyond its literal sense. It's a powerful expression that captures the essence of covering up flaws and presenting a facade of respectability. We hope this exploration has been enlightening and adds another interesting phrase to your English vocabulary. Remember, language is not just about words, it's about the stories and meanings behind them. Until our next video, Keep exploring and enjoying the beauty of English.